is FYI on your TV, brought to you by Hometown News. I'm Kathy Botham, and I have got Maddie McLeod with me, and you are from the Rideau Lakes Public Libraries, libraries too. We got to make sure everybody knows that. Four, yep. five, five locations? Five branches. Yeah, okay. five branches of the township. Yep. All right. Can you name them? I can. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we've got Newbro, we've got Delta, we've got one in Elgin, uh, we've got one in South Elmsley, and Portland. Okay. Now, you are the promotion... Lovely. You're the promotion and resources person, so there's a lot going on at your library, so you must be quite busy. <laughs> I'm a busy lady. I'm a busy lady, that's right. Okay, yeah, now they I, keep you on the phone. I have Laura Lee here uh, quite often, and there's always something going on. But this is, I think, the first time we've talked about this. We've got a casting call going out. Yeah, it's very exciting. So we are producing um, a version of Murder by the Books, which is a library fundraiser um, that was created by um, a playwright in Quebec. And so she created this uh, murder mystery. So it's a very light, funny, you know, comical murder mystery play that she uh, um, put on for, uh, to raise funds for her local library. It just so happens that Louise Penny, who is a prolific and very well-known international best-selling author, uh, lives in that town. And so she ended up joining um, the playwright and, and endorsing this play. So it's this phenomenal play, super fun, super light, that they have made available to all libraries throughout Canada um, to, uh, to put on as a library fundraiser. So we thought that would be a great thing to do for our community. So you're going to be putting on a play too. Can you talk a little bit about the storyline? Like, I don't want to give anything away, but it okay. is a murder mystery. Um, okay. So it's an eight person play, um, very uh, farcical, very fun very light-hearted, uh, sort of along the veins of, you know, like an Agatha Christie kind of murder mystery. It's a whodunit. Okay. Yeah. Now, did you say eight yeah. person? Eight person? So you need eight, eight people? Person. Okay. Eight people. So what are you yeah. looking for? Like children, adults? Uh... It's, it's adults. It's adults, it's but adults. it's pretty much 18 to 88. This is what I put on the casting call uh, because it's re it really ranges. I really don't, don't mind uh, the age. We need a little bit of everything. Okay. You know? Okay. Now your casting call, you've got them Saturday, February 24th and Sunday, February 25th. That's right. So, and I'm doing it in two different locations just because we know our township is gigantic. So graphically we're, we're, you know, we're quite lar large. Um, so we have the Saturday, the 24th is in Delta at the uh, United church. And then Sunday, the 25th is in Morton hall. Um, and so the best way to sort of get, you know, get a time slot is to contact me. So that's maddie at rlpl.ca. Um, we're doing it between two and four, but it's great if you contact me and I give you a little time slot so you're not sort of waiting around for two hours, you know. <laughs> absolutely, yeah. absolutely. So the yeah. show itself is going to be May 30th? The show itself opens on May 30th. And where's that going to be presented? So we are going to do a four show run at the Delta Old Town Hall. Wow. Yeah, with uh, yeah, it's going to be pretty huge. We're doing a, a matinee. We're doing dinner theater. Wow. It's uh, it's yeah, it's a heck of an undertaking. But yes. you know, I think we've got the talent to support it. Um, yeah, I'm really excited to see everybody sort of come out and support our local libraries. Are you the director? I am not. Oh, no, you're not. I am not. I'm actually, so in my, I, I have a theater background, which is why I jumped on this project. So I um, am a props person and I'm a scenic artist. So I'm, I'm the, you know, behind the scenes person. I'm a production uh, person, but I uh, no, I got a local director. We have a local stage manager um, with some experience as well, which is great. Um, so we're really casting all of these roles and, and you know, casting out the net to our local talent. Uh, have you got mm -hmm. some interest already? Quite a bit. Really? Yeah, quite wow. a bit, but we'll always accept more, you know? Yeah. As, as, Many hands make light work, right? Absolutely, because I'm thinking, you know, between Smith Falls and Kingston, there really isn't a lot of opportunities to do any theater work, so this would be a great opportunity for people. I think so, too. I think so, too, and I think people are kind of itching to be a part of something like this, you know? I know I am, so. Yeah, yeah absolutely, absolutely. So the show itself starts May 30th, and you've got four runs at it? That's right. And this That's will be a right. fundraiser for the library. It's a fundraiser for the library, so all everything goes back to the library, which is great, and it's going to really help us out with some of the branch improvements uh, that we need to do, um, as well as the possible Portland build. Okay, so looking forward, do you already know where tickets are going to be available, or is it just first come, first serve? How, do, how are you going to do that? Oh, we're going to be doing a, a definitely a reserve your, okay. your spot sort of thing, and it's going to be available um, in branch and online, so we will be sort of promoting that pretty heavily. I feel like once we have the full thing cast, which is coming up again in the, in the next week or two, um, I'll be able to really 
start booming about it, you know, and yeah. start really promoting the heck out of it. Um, so yeah, those will be available on our website um, in branch and, and you'll see it pop up in different places. It's going to be um, online orders or, or, you know, we can take the cash uh, in branch as well. Okay. Cause yeah. one thing I've learned from talking to Laura Lee and you uh, is things fill up quite quickly <laughs> with your events at the libraries. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Well, I mean, Laura Lee's amazing. We put on great programming. So, oh. you know, it's, it's an incredible organization to be a part of. Well, you I guys are a great team too. You've got like, a, we, we can mention a paint uh, club you've got going on once a month. The next one's at February 26th. That's right. In South Elmsley. Yeah, we do that once a month. We have a very dedicated, uh, you know, group of people who love painting, but we're always, you know, we always open the doors to have more, you know, it's a, and that's one of our other constant sort of library fundraisers. So a great way to support your local library while making awesome art, while spending, you know, a wonderful night with friends. Absolutely. You know, so and I, I saw on your Facebook page too, and I don't know whether it's a, an annual event or a weekly event or whatever, or just an upcoming event, a puzzle race. I thought that is so cool. It's oh really cool. It went really well. It was a challenging puzzle. Holy moly. 500 pieces in 41 minutes. Yeah. Well, that was, I mean, that team was incredible. I have no idea how they... And it was only a three-person team. It was amazing. Just to watch the mark was incredible. And it was a complex, you know, it's a complex puzzle that we did. It was. So we'll be doing those um, monthly as well. That's a monthly. Yeah. I, what a, that was a great idea. Whoever thought of that, that's kudos to them. That was really interesting. Oh, wow. Well, to be honest, we're, we're joining our neighbors in doing that. So I know Brockville is doing it as well. And so we'll actually be doing sort of like in, you know, neighborhood puzzle races all together, you yeah. know, even outside of our friendship. So it's very exciting. Wow. 500 pieces. Somebody got it done in 41 minutes. Isn't that incredible? That's incredible. <laughs> That's amazing. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'd still be making the round, the, <laughs> the edges. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. All right, so once again, your casting call for Murder by the Books. Let's talk the, the dates and how to get hold of you. Yeah, so casting call, Murder by the Books. Uh, we're looking for anyone and everyone. Um, you know, give us just a, a quick monologue, anything you want to talk about. We'll also have a couple pages of the play uh, sort of set to go when you show up. Um, really, really just chill out about it, though. You know, we're not, uh, <laughs> yeah. you know, any theater production. Uh, but you can contact me, maddie at rlpl.ca. Um, and we are going to be hosting them two to four. Um, so contact me for a time slot between two to four. Um, Saturday, February 24th at Delta uh, United Church. And then Sunday, February 25th at Morton Hall. Wonderful. Look forward to this. This sounds like a lot of fun. So much fun. Yeah. We're that's, excited. That's a prerequisite to, to be at the library. You guys always have fun. <laughs> We do. do. We're pretty recklessly fun. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you very much for joining us today. Maddie McLean, the promotions and resource person for our Rideau Lakes Public Libraries, five locations. Thanks for joining us. Thank you so much. <laughs> Take care.